In today's video, we'll assemble the iPhone 15 Pro and compare it with the iPhone 14 Pro, to see the difference between these two. Applied with titanium, the iPhone 15 Pro weighs less. Since the 15 Pro and Pro Max are disassembled in much the same way. Please check our previous video for details. Today, we're focusing on the changes to the main parts and evaluate the repair difficulties. Just like iPhone 14 Pro, the screen opens as the same way. First, let's check it at front side. The 15 Pro lack of the two opening position for proximity sensors and newly applied strong adhesive white glue. The refurbishment would be more challenging. Moreover, the 15 Pro screen's thickness has increased slightly. Next, let's compare it with the back of the screen. Compared with 14 Pro, it has a much narrower bezel. The connector size remains the same. Next, we snap the 14 Pro's display cable into iPhone 15 Pro's motherboard and test its compatibility. The display function is normal. While the touch cannot work, the two screens are not interchangeable. Fifteen Pro adds the LiDAR protecting foam. The connector of ultra wide and telephoto are separate. Their position has switched. Here we are checking the true depth camera assembly. The 15 Pro's flood illuminator is integrated into the dot projector. Later, we compare the main changes between two motherboards. From the logic board, the NOND position has changed. It has less surrounding components. Makes the repair safer. Besides, NFC, amplifier and wireless charging connector are switched to the back. From the motherboard schematic, there is no place for preset card slot. So we conclude that converting SIM would be harder. As we can see, both batteries have an L-shaped appearance. There are cathode and anode added on 15 Pro. The capacity of iPhone 15 Pro is 3274 mAh. While 14 Pro is 3200 mAh. The battery weights are 44.4 grams and 44.8 grams. The connector cables are the same. So we swapped them and test. The battery data cannot be read. That's no charge, and no battery health. Next, we proceed the comparison with the charging cable. The appearance is almost the same. Swap with another original cable. There is no pop-up message and can be charged. The iPhone 15 Pro's back glass can be removed separately. While the 14 Pro is in one piece, which requires laser machine to repair. The flashlight and the microphone transmitter are integrated on the wireless charger. At last, we try to put the 15 Pro Max back cover in Toy Phone 15 Pro's motherboard to see what would happen. The phone can be turned on, the wireless charging works fine. However it's still auto restart. We check and found that it was the wireless charging error. We will continue to follow up whether the part is encrypted. Finally, it's time to review the results. For more new discoveries and repair, please subscribe to the channel.